good morning it is very early i was up at three tried to get myself to go back to sleep until my alarm went off at four i laid in bed for like 20 minutes couldn't do it decided to just get up and get moving because i've got a lot to get done this weekend i am taking bacardi and bits to a horse show next weekend so i have all of my usual stuff to do on the weekends on top of all the stuff i need to get done for the horse show next weekend so it is good that i woke up an hour before my alarm because i'm gonna need all the time i can get so anyways it is still very cold out i have one literally as many clothes as I possibly can get on my body except for I only have on one pair of pants and so that's probably not the smartest but that's what we're doing today no Nelson Nelson <laughs> why are you doing that I'm gonna get these fatty as fudge so they'll stop swarming me. There you go, fatties. I'm about to hop on Grumpy Little Thunderbutt. He's currently trying to eat everything I own. Hey, can you not do that to me? Thunder. Let go of it, Thunder. I'm really having second thoughts about being up this early. It is freaking cold. I like don't even know who I am anymore. I'm just like here, but I don't really feel like I'm here because I'm so cold. It's probably bad. I'm gonna do some jumping jacks, maybe like a mini little workout to try and warm myself up. Athena, move your fat body. No, you're in the way. This is a great idea. So sometimes when I do jumping jacks, I like to spin in circles. I go like this. I just went inside for a few minutes. I brushed my hair and I put some sweatpants on over my breeches. Hopefully I can keep myself warmer while I'm getting the horse ready and still be decently warm when I get on the horse. I'm about to get on Bacardi. I don't feel as cold as I did when I was about to get on Thunder, so that is a good sign. Bacardi's just gonna flat today. I jumped him a few days ago and he was jumping great, so I don't really think I'm gonna jump him again before the horse show. I don't really think he needs it. I'm gonna insert some video from when I jumped him a few days ago. We put the jumps up a little bit for him. It's the biggest he's jumped since his whole injury thing and whatnot. Um,
we're gonna have to let this hose thaw out so that we can get some water on the bee pulp. Where there's a will, there's a way. We just did all the beet pulp by hand. It was actually kind of fun. Yeah. It was kind of ridiculous, but fun. I didn't really feel like waiting on the hose to thaw out, so found a different way to get it done. Are you being me? I got some fleece lined boots and they just got here. I have them on right now. I'm about to get on Pablo. I'm gonna jump him today if he's being good. Might have Riley hop on him for a few minutes because she hasn't jumped him in a really long time. I'm pretty much keeping the kids off of him as much as possible right now because he really just needs to hang out with me for a little bit and rebuild his confidence over fences and work on the lead change. So yeah, he's not done a whole lot with the kids, but he is getting a hang of the lead change. Are your boots on the right feet? <laughs> you cannot be serious right now. Yes, they are. Hold are this, you sure? Hold this, hold it, hold it. Why do they look backwards to me? They're backwards? I think so, yeah. <laughs> yes, Bella. They're on the wrong feet. You look like a superhero. <laughs> Bella and Chloe are here for their lesson. Bella is lessening on Roxy and Chloe is going to do Frankie today. I'm going to insert some video of Roxy from her training ride yesterday. A few moments later. <laughs> you can do it.
Hi, Flashy. I'm gonna show you guys some video of Flash jumping the other day because he was again jumping like a freak. He snaps his little knees up and he's really cute. Of course she wants it. <laughs> <laughs> she likes anything she can eat. <laughs> so take what you want and then I'll take the rest of the bag. I, we settled on a handful. Oh, we did it! Oh my god! Okay, let's put some of her in a baggie. Here's your wrapper. Put them in <laughs> you want another one? Here, you want another one? Oh, she does like them. <laughs> That's enough for her. Okay. Look at the belly on this thing. They're making me leave the tack room so they can hide the Twizzlers from me because if I know where they're at, I'm gonna eat them all. I'll, I'll leave. <laughs> Bella, you dropped them all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Eat them all. Your dad's gonna love this when he sees this. Look what you did. <laughs> that's what they're falling. You just ripped I'm open and ran you back. <gasps> Get! Two. It's your turn. This one's the clean one. I got him, bro. She ate like ten off the ground already. No, 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 I'm not sharing it with you. I was showing the camera. This is my food. You had snacks earlier. <laughs> you can't just wait another 30 seconds. done with Luna. She was awesome today. She's been really, really good lately. I put Erilyn on her last night, which is the youngest and most inexperienced kid that has been on her. And Luna was really good for her. So we're making progress with that little pony. <laughs> oh, I farted. Oh, I farted one more time. <laughs> what? I love you. <laughs> Are you going to be Mr. Grumpy Pants? Mr. Sassy Pants. <laughs> <laughs> Just say it again. Stop biting me. <laughs> say it. <laughs> Mr. Sassy Pants. <laughs> Mr. Grumpy Pants. Mista.
You can literally just throw it over, he's not going to care. We just got done with Geronimo. He was really great. Riley hasn't been on him since over the summer, but she had a much easier time riding him today because he's a lot more confident in himself and what he is supposed to be doing. So he was a lot less confused. There was a lot less of him just stopping and looking at me. Honestly, she had a pretty easy time keeping him trotting. So that's good and exciting to see. Riley's getting Marco ready for me right now. I think he's the last one I'm gonna do today because I am running out of energy. I have been going for, I think like 12 hours now. <laughs> um, that's a lot. It's really a lot of time. I don't think my horses like me. Not sure that I blame them tripped over the hose for the 10th time today still in here i need to take it back outside because it's really not super cold right now it's like cold but nothing like it was this morning it was like 10 degrees this morning i know it could be worse but for me that's pretty cold uh... <laughs> <laughs> ready <laughs> One more time. Are you crying? <laughs> I'll ride Marco for you. <laughs> How long have you had Marco? Probably longer than he cares for me to. Probably one day with me was enough for him. Long. <laughs> what did you? <laughs> I'm trying to say longer. I've been awake for too long. Ah! What's a donkey? Oh, this is a donkey. We have a working hose. Where are the Twizzlers at? Bella, when you see Hi. this, Riley told me. Hello, gang. I just got the horses fed. Riley is inside on cane right now, so I am going to head in and check on her and make sure she's doing okay. Just got in, I saw her trot past, so she's still on the horse, which is great because they are shooting guns right now, so I was a little bit worried that like cane would spook or something and she'd be on the ground when I came back in, but she is still on the horse. It is the next day. I let myself sleep in a little bit this morning 
so I am not getting as early of a start as I did yesterday because 3 a.m. is a little bit insane and I was awake for like 18 hours yesterday and that's a pretty long time to be awake and like be working so it's getting closer to six right now last night i got the grain ready for the two horses i'm taking to the show next weekend that's one big task complete and then we went inside and ate dinner hello bobo <laughs> hello bobo hello bobo hello mark <laughs> I took a very hot shower and then I tried to edit for a little bit, didn't get a whole lot done, and then I was asleep by like 8.30. I have chores this morning, so that is what I am going to get started on. Can't wait. Twenty minutes later. This is how I woke Riley up this morning. Get up, Riley! <laughs> Get up now! <laughs> and I also put my cold hands on her face. I'm ready to do it now. I was like, Get up, Riley! Get up now! <laughs> we should make a whole video and this one. I think we would like lose our voice doing this all the time. Remember when I couldn't speak at the horse show? Yeah, that was nice. <laughs> well, Baxi's gone, so you can't run him over. I haven't been in here with you driving in a long time, and I'm a little frightened. Oh my god! You are a... <laughs> what? You, you are a... A maniac? What? Do it. I'm trying, I can't get all the words out. You are a bad driver! <laughs> <laughs> no, don't eat it out of my hand. <laughs> you are weird! I'm gonna do Geronimo first, and I think I'm gonna jump him. Does he only jump crossroads or has he jumped vertical? He has never jumped a vertical, but I would like to do that soon. Maybe today.
You're a good boy. Geronimo was awesome jumping today. That was his first time cantering a line, his first vertical. The first time he jumped a line was last week. He's really making a lot of progress because they've been riding him consistently. Funny how that works. You know, you put in the work and things get better. Hello, Pablo. I will hit you with this. No, you won't. I have your camera. No. I know. That is the only thing that is on me. I dumped all the brushes out because there was poop in it. Riley? Riley is learning. I got another new thing. And she goes, if it will keep you warm, then it's reasonable. Exactly. It's perfectly reasonable because I'm cold and I need clothes that will keep me warm. Do I need as many as I bought? Probably not. No. Wait, how many did you buy? Just this one. No, you didn't. There was just this one in that one package. <laughs> I am not weird. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> Today was a lot better with Bacardi than yesterday because I wasn't completely frozen when I was trying to ride him. So I could actually feel what I was doing and it was just definitely a much, much better ride. So that makes me feel a lot better. I'm gonna head out and get the tractor started and let it warm up while I'm untacking him because I think it is for sure warm enough to get the arena dragged. So that's the plan. Riley is in Flash's stall getting him ready for her lesson. Riley just had a really good lesson on Flash. He is a little bit of a chicken. But if you give him a confident ride, he will go over the jump. So Riley's just been trying to figure out how to be that person for him and be the leader and like tell him that it is okay and that the jumps aren't going to kill him. And today she finally figured out how to sit up and fight to get that pony over the jump. And once she did that, that was all that pony needed. Then he was totally game for everything and she didn't have another issue with him. So it was a big breakthrough. Hopefully Riley can remember her ride today and we can keep building off of that. He's been great for me and we've been jumping him up a little bit, but I think he really just needed for Riley to be able to tell him that like you 
are going to go over the jumps with me too. Um, Riley just turned the lights on. That's why the lighting just changed a little bit. Can you stay? Can you stay? No, I cannot stay. Yes, I, can. I am trashy fuzzy. No. He's gonna go find food. <laughs> what do you think he's doing? He's looking for food. Oh. She's kind of taken a few steps back with him, just trying to like figure out how to be a confident rider for him. And so we've just been kind of slowly building back into jumping. And so today was the first time she's cantered jumps on him in a really long time. So it was just, it was a really good lesson. I am going to go outside and get Kane and Frankie in. Riley is gonna ride Frankie. I'm gonna do Kane before Belle and Chloe get here for their lesson. And I just have their lessons. And then I just have to jump bits and I'm gonna sleep. Really? No, I'm gonna edit. <laughs> there is no time to sleep. I don't know why I'm talking like that. <laughs> there is nothing wrong with me. I don't know where the Twizzlers are at, Bella. I did not eat any. Even yeah. though there's literally a video of me eating them. I'm pretty sure she won't care. I didn't eat any, okay? She tore off full in the bag. Riley definitely did not tell me. Yeah. <laughs> she told me willingly. I didn't even have to coerce her or anything. She just told me. Sorry, Bella. I made Kane a song and Riley's gonna sing it for you. Monk, monk. Mr. Chunk, chunk. I love you, bunch, bunch. Monk, monk. Mr. Chunk, chunk. chunk. I love you, bunch, bunch. Stop it. Bite her ear off. <laughs> Good girl, Athena. Aw, her face. That's so mean. Nobody move. You have to say freeze. Freeze. Roxy's trying too. Look. <laughs> Roxy, your ears are moving. Stop.
And she just stood there and stared at it. <laughs> You have to have your eyes open. <laughs> Look at from the handle side, not the hidden side. Really the nice no, 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 no. You had it right. Yeah, that's it. Oh, you might need to practice. <laughs> All my lessons are done for the day. Everyone had really, really good rides. I just got done with Bits. He was like, all right, jumping. A little excited about it, but honestly, his flat work just needs a lot more work. I did jump Bits a little bigger earlier this week just to kind of really build his confidence before the show. Today, we just kind of worked on some simple things like mainly just keeping him straight. That's a big issue. Bitsy, you need to be a good boy at the horse show. Can you please do that for me? I will feed you cookies. As far as Bella and Chloe's lessons went, they both haven't jumped in like a few months. They've been kind of working on just basic flat work and like position stuff and this is the first time they've jumped in a while and they both looked really good i've been doing a lot of work with roxy and can definitely see some of it paying off because bella had a much easier time jumping her today roxy was a little more chill a little more you know ready to take care of a kid really overall just a lot less excited about things which is good that's what we want and then pablo was perfect for chloe they are so cute together i feel like a freaking zombie You're gonna hit yourself in the head with that. <laughs> 